Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to get all the Gorka joggers in GTA 5 online so I hope you find this video helpful. If you do, a like would be massively appreciated. Also, feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. That's all up to you though, but before we get into it, shout out to all of these people on screen for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. Anyway, let's get straight into the video. So to start off with this glitch, you will first want to come to any clothing store on the map and then you want to put all your money in your bank, so make sure it is in your bank. And then what you need to do is go up to your saved outfits and equip the saved outfit that you would like to keep as by doing a glitch it will delete all your saved outfits. And then from here just delete all your saved outfits yourself as it will make sure nothing messes up. Uh, regardless though, they do get deleted, even if you try and keep them. But from here open up your pause menu, head over to swap character. Now in this menu here you want to make sure your main character is a male and on the left slot or else it will not work. But from here you want to make a new female character in the right slot here. And then if you do get this alert in a moment, yeah this one, you want to accept this alert. And then in the editing section just make sure you set it to a female if it isn't. Then from here you want to press save and continue then name the character anything and you should load into a public session. Before we carry on, I do just want to let you guys know if you would like any of your own modded accounts that come with modded outfits on them and plenty of cash and RP, be sure to head over to MitchCactus.com. These modded accounts come with cash ranging from 50 million all the way to 1 billion, and almost all of the modded accounts now are 100% cash, so no need for extra cars and deluxos. They also offer account boosts, which are great because you can get an already existing account boosted with tons of money and RP. These guys have over 4,500 reviews on their official Trustpilot page and are by far the most highly reputable modders. There will be a link in the description and the pinned comment to this website. Uh, and also, don't forget you can use my code TJRH for 5% off your order for a limited time only. Anyway, back to the video. Once you load in, you want to check to see if you have any clothing stores. If you don't, just find a new session. When you load in this time, you should notice you have clothing stores on the map, so head over to any clothing store. In the clothing store you just want to head over to the back onto the accessories menu. So at the back right of the store go on accessories and you need to take off any accessories that come with the outfit so most standard outfits come with earrings uh, so you want to take those off if you have any. This one didn't come with any accessories uh, but from here to start off with the uh, outfit you want to first go to gloves and equip the light woodland armoured. So these ones here light woodland armoured then head over to the shoe section and head down to the high heel boots. Then go for the Deluxe Midnight Combat Boots. After you have those equipped, you want to head over to the uh, Pants section. Then on this menu here, go onto Sports Pants and equip the first ones here, so the Spotted Muscle Pants. Then once you have those, go onto Tops. On here, just head down to the Gun Running T-shirts. So go up to gun running t-shirts, then go for the last one, which is the blue digital t-shirt. So this one here, number 60. Now after you have this, go up to work jackets. And then head down to the peach camo closed field and equip that one. So just down here, the peach camo closed field, equip this and then go ahead and save this. Now you want to save it to slot number 2. And then if you want to, just name it anything. from here you want to go on to tops again and then this time head down to the tactical jackets and equip the khaki tactical at the bottom here number 79 now after you've equipped that head down to bikinis and then you want to go for the black bikini so this one up here the black bikini then once you have this you want to go ahead and save this uh, just save it underneath the other outfit so to slot number three and uh, name it whatever you want to uh, or if, just to make it easier just name it the same as i do and once you have that, you should have both the outfits complete now, so just make sure they are the same as these. And then from here, all you need to do is just take the easy way out using your interaction menu. When you load back in, just open up your pause menu, go to online and then start up creator. In this menu, hit create a race and then go to land race.
Now I've gone to race details and the title, description and photo do not matter so they can be anything. So do those and then what does matter is you need to set max players to 3 and then set the route type to point to point and then if you want to choose any supercar just to make it a bit quicker and then from here warp to the airport. Now over here place gone placement and you want to place the trigger anywhere and then take a photo of anything for the lobby camera. Now place checkpoints and you want to place it until the race is at least 0.62 miles long so until that red warning icon goes away. Once you've done that, just test the race. Then just accept this alert here, then open up your pause menu, go to online and then go on to choose a character. In this menu here, you just want to delete your female character. Now from here, if you are on next gen, what you need to do is you need to join someone in a different targeting mode in an online session. So either through your friends list or wherever. Uh, however, if you're on PC or, or old gen, just press B or circle to back out to story mode. On next gen, if you do join someone in a different targeting mode, it should just take you straight to story mode. Now in story mode, you just want to start up a new online invite only session. When you load into online, all you want to do is just go ahead and save this outfit. So the one you chose to keep, you can just go ahead and save this, uh, but save it to slot number 20 at the bottom. You should also notice that the outfits from the female have transferred over. So from here, you want to go onto the Gorka suits and then equip any of these uh, Gorka pants that you want to turn into joggers. So choose any of these, it works with all of them, and you can repeat this glitch over and over, uh, this last part of the glitch, to get all the joggers. Also, equip the gloves you would like on your outfit, and then from here you want to go to online jobs, play job, bookmarked, go to missions, and you will need to start up It's a G thing, so you'll need to bookmark this, I'll leave a link to it in the description, uh, so bookmark it, restart your game, and then start this up. Or if you have it bookmarked already, just start it up straight away, and then in this menu, set the clothing to player saved outfits, and then invite anyone and start this up. Now on owned outfit you want to scroll two to the right, then one back to the left, then just ready up. Now in the mission all you need to do is just go to any one of your apartments so you'll need to know where they are as they don't show up on the minimap. Inside your apartment, you just want to go up to the apartment wardrobe. And then go ahead and save this outfit to any slot, just make sure it isn't in slot number one. Uh, so make sure it's below the Gorka one and two outfits you made. And then from here, just quit a job using your phone. When you spawn in, you can go ahead and equip the outfit you just saved and you'll notice uh, it's fully saved, it fully works. Uh, but by the way, you can do this with all the Gorka joggers, so you can now go and equip some other Gorka pants and gloves and then do the same thing again and get the same outfit, just with different Gorka pants. So yeah, feel free to repeat this last bit over and over again to get all of them. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, a like would be massively appreciated. Also comment down below if you made it this far into the video. Uh, but anyway, have an awesome day or night and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.